I'm here at Distributech with Thal at the Appian booth. Thal, a couple of years ago at Distributech, a CEO of a large utility stood up and said, my utility is turning into a software company. Software is a, a critical part of our infrastructure. What does Appian do in the, the software world? So Appian creates a platform to allow you to build applications very rapidly. Right. So today the alternative is to either build it from the ground up, so that's traditional development, yep. or you use an off-the-shelf product and you hope that it does what you need it to do. Okay. And maybe you can do some configuration, but in our platform we can build applications 20 times faster than you can if you were to do it from scratch. 20 times? 20 times is what Forrester says, yes. Okay. Now, when we were chatting earlier, you said that the way that you do this is you you use low code. Yes. I gotta ask, what's low code? So low code is the category to contrast it with no code, which means okay. that there is simply everything is done in a designer. In a, in a GUI. In a GUI. So I use my mouse to yes. move things around. Yes, and so in low-code environment, also in no-code environments, you simply draw your process, okay. you lay out your screens, and now you have an application. But sometimes we don't give you all of the functionality you need, so you may need to do a little coding. And that's where the low-code comes from. Yes. Okay. So then that changes... So I, I came out of a... Many years ago, so we were all coding C, C++, whatever. Which is all good. Absolutely. Um, but with low code and potentially no code and whatever, what does that do to the, the skill sets that the utilities need in their in their companies going forward? How, does that change the, 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 the skills, the competencies they require? Uh, to some degree. The good news is, because it's so easy to use, that with two weeks of training, okay. we can have a technical person productive in building applications. And I would say as, as many as half of our customers will have a business focused person yeah. learn how to do it and they actually start coding in two weeks. If you can use a spreadsheet, and you're pretty good at a spreadsheet, you can probably use um, the designer within two weeks, no problem. So if I'm able to develop applications 20 times faster than the traditional way, uh -huh. so as utilities look to, as the industry evolves and they look at, we need to have new services. Mm -hmm. So I'm a, dis a distribution operator. I know I need to start offering services to e-vehicle chargers and I need to start doing energy storage. As they rapidly decide on business models and markets, then they can start creating applications as fast to, they, they yep. don't need to wait two years for oh, some right. massive development cycle we actually have some customers that start creating applications in little as two weeks because what happens is we are big promoters of agile as a methodology okay so you put together something that kind of works yeah you show it around you sell it internally and then you continue to enhance it so not only it's not two two years it's not two months in some cases so the ability to, to the nirvana of being able to deploy new services as they as the business needs them, then this is where the software industry is changing. Yes, and we are giving love to parts of businesses that today don't have any software. Wow. So. Pretty cool. I wish you well. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Looking forward to it.